there are a lot of reasons why the ocean is terrifying. The ocean may make up a huge portion of our planet, but it's still relatively unexplored, and for good reason. For one, the abyss of the ocean is incredibly dark, and the deeper you go, the more the crushing pressure will overwhelm you. What's more is that the entirety of it is pretty much a hurricane zone and a lightning magnet. If you're still not terrified by these natural phenomena, then you'll surely say nope once you see what lurks underwater. From the beautiful but deadly lionfish to the moray eel, here are the 15 most dangerous ocean creatures in the world. Number 15. Lionfish The lionfish is certainly one of the most eye-catching fish in the ocean. These creatures are native to the Indo-Pacific, and they're most known for their colors and their fan-like pectoral fins. They're pretty to look at, but just wait until you know more about them. Because of their distinct white stripes, they're also known as zebrafish or butterfly cod. An adult lionfish can grow up to 18 inches. They may not be gigantic in size, but don't be fooled. The red, white, and black colors combined usually signifies a warning for many animals. The lionfish, with its red, white, black, and creamy bands, tells its predators that it's extremely venomous. Those spiky fin rays and pectoral fins aren't just for show. They're pretty to look at, but trust me, you wouldn't want to touch them. Lionfish are hazardous for both fishermen and divers. Being stung by one of their fins will usually cause you to experience extreme pain, nausea, fever, headache, heartburn, breathing difficulties, temporary paralysis, and in some cases, even death. Their venom is most especially dangerous for kids and for adults that have a compromised immune system or those who are allergic to their venom. Despite these terrifying side effects, did you know that these creatures also have a very strange nickname? Lionfish are also called tasty fish by some people. You see, in some parts of the world, they're seen as tasty delicacies, as long as they're prepared correctly. Before we go on, like this video, smash the subscribe button, and click the notification bell right now. Number 14. Portuguese Man of War If you see something that looks like a plastic bag that's about 12 inches long and 5 inches wide, then you better get out of the water. This is the Portuguese Man of War. Most people will either mistake it for a jellyfish or for a harmless plastic floating in the ocean, but they couldn't be more wrong. The Portuguese Man of War isn't just one creature. In fact, it's an entire colony of organisms working together. Their tentacles make up most of the organisms. Their long tendrils can extend up to a whopping 165 feet in length below the water. These tendrils are their ultimate weapon. If you ever get stuck by them, you would feel excruciating pain. For the other fish in the ocean, getting stung by their venom-filled tendrils would mean imminent death. One sting and they won't be able to move. Once their prey is paralyzed, the Portuguese man-o-war would then consume them. The pain of their sting may be searing and incredibly agonizing, but they aren't really deadly for humans. Well, usually. They're usually found worldwide in tropical to temperate oceans, and if groups of them are found in one area, it's best for people to avoid swimming. Number 13. Sea Snakes Just when you thought that the ocean couldn't get scarier, you'll learn that there are also nope ropes in the ocean. Introducing the Sea Snake Countless scuba divers exploring the oceans of Australia reported their encounter with these snakes that can reach a terrifying length of up to six feet. Sea snakes prefer to stay in the warm tropical waters of the Indian and Pacific Oceans. They aren't really aggressive, but some of them are known to attack divers without any provocation. Anyone will certainly be thrown off if they come across a snake zigzagging through the water and zooming towards them. For so long, these sea snakes have been misunderstood. Apparently, some of them seem to attack humans unprovoked, but in reality, their aggression is just their urgent quest to find love during the mating season. Still, if you ever come across a sea snake, it's better to keep your distance because their venom is incredibly deadly. Only 3% of sea snake bites are fatal, and they're usually painless. You might not even notice that you've been bitten sometimes, but in the slim chance that you get bitten by a highly venomous one, you'll start feeling like your tongue is getting heavier excessive sweating, nausea, and extreme thirst. After that, you'll start feeling paralysis spread throughout your body, as well as tenderness in your muscles. If you encounter these symptoms while you're in the water, it can be extremely fatal because not only can you drown, but there's also a chance that you won't receive medical aid. Number 12. Pufferfish 
There's a general rule for all creatures on Earth. Just because something looks cute and cuddly, it doesn't automatically mean they're friendly. For instance, the pufferfish may look extremely cute, especially in their puffed up appearance, but their poison can kill you within minutes. After all, they're the second most poisonous vertebrate in the world, right after the golden poison frog. These creatures contain a toxin called tetrodotoxin, which is about 1,200 times more poisonous than cyanide. There's enough toxin in one pufferfish to kill 30 adult humans. And the worst part? There's no known antidote. There are more than 120 species of these creatures spread all around the world. They're easily recognizable, so if you ever spot one in the water, you'll know that it's time to keep your distance and get out of their territory. These creatures can grow up to three feet long. They usually have some vibrant and wild markings and colors to warn their predators of their toxicity. However, some of them also have muted colorings, which helps them to blend with their environment. One thing is distinct about them though, they're all lethal and they can all infiltrate and turn themselves into a ball several times their normal size to make them look inedible to their predators. These creatures are carnivores, mostly preying on invertebrates like clams, mussels, other shellfish, as well as algae. Pufferfish poison can make your tongue and lips feel numb, and you'll soon have a rapid heart rate, decreased blood pressure, and muscle paralysis. The source of their toxin is still highly debated, but it's generally agreed that their toxins come from their intestinal tract. But did you know that just like the lionfish, pufferfish are also seen as delicacies in some parts of the world, most especially in Japan? Pufferfish meat is called fugu in Japan, and it's extremely expensive. Only licensed chefs can butcher and cook their meat to ensure that the cut wouldn't contain any poison. If you ever get the chance, would you dare to sample this potentially deadly meat? Number 11. Barracuda This fish is known as the Great Barracuda. They're large fish that usually live in subtropical oceans around the world. Great Barracudas usually grow up to 39 inches in length and they weigh more than 19 pounds. However, big ones can grow up to 5 feet and weigh over a staggering 51 pounds. You're probably wondering why they made it to this list. Well, Barracudas don't really attack humans, but there are cases when they bite divers. These creatures are scavengers, which means they follow around large predators in the hopes of getting some leftovers. Sometimes they might mistake scuba divers as larger predators, and they attack and bite them because the glint and shine of their gear may give the impression of prey. Barracudas are also popular candidates when fishing, but they'll surely put up a fight if you ever get them on your hook. And most of all, you'll be discouraged to add them to your catch for the day because they release a really pungent odor when they're caught. Number 10. Blue Ringed Octopus This fella is the Blue Ringed Octopus. It might look harmless, but trust me, this guy can easily kill you. Native to the Pacific Ocean, the Blue Ringed Octopus are usually found resting in the soft and sandy parts of shallow tide pools and coral reefs. The moment you see them threatened, you'll understand how they got their name. Whenever these creatures feel threatened, they give off a warning signal to potential predators. Blue rings will appear all over their body, signifying that they're feeling threatened, and they're extremely deadly. Its venom is a thousand times more powerful than cyanide, and despite their size, one blue ringed octopus contains enough venom to kill 26 humans within minutes. With this lethal punch, it's no wonder that it's considered to be a powerhouse among the deadliest creatures in the ocean. They usually prey on crabs, shrimp, and small fish. Once they have their tentacles on their prey, they'll peck their beak on them and slowly inject their venom in them. While their prey is paralyzed, they'll slowly consume them. Now, you're probably wondering what will happen if you get bitten by a blue ringed octopus. For starters, its venom will block all the nerve signals throughout your body. You'll first start feeling numbness all over your body. After that, you'll feel nauseous and you'll slowly lose your vision and sometimes even your sense of hearing as well. After that, you'll lose the ability to move. This includes the organs inside of you. Ultimately, a person who doesn't receive medical treatment immediately will die because of respiratory arrest. There's no known antidote for the octopus's venom, but victims can be saved if they immediately get treatment. Number 9. Stonefish Ugly, elusive, but extremely toxic. While the lionfish parades around the water with their spiky fins, the stonefish is unassuming and prefers to stay on the rocky or muddy parts of the Indo-Pacific Ocean. Just as their name suggests, the stonefish looks like a stone or coral, 
They're usually brown with orange, red, or yellow patches scattered all over their bodies. They're so great at hiding themselves that you wouldn't even notice if you swim right past them. The good thing about these creatures is that they're not really known to attack humans, but they hide and blend into their environment so well that if you're not careful, you might step on them and become a victim of their deadly venom. If you happen to step on them, you'll immediately feel searing pain. One victim even claimed that he felt as if his knuckles, wrists, elbows, and shoulders were being hit by a sledgehammer over and over again. Imagine how painful that is. After being stung, the tissues will now slowly die, and soon enough, you'll breathe your very last breath. This is why divers are usually advised to be very aware of their surroundings when exploring the ocean, and a protective covering on their feet also helps as well. Number 8. Anglerfish This is the anglerfish. Not only are they the most hideous creatures in the ocean, but they also have one of the most terrifying lifestyles. First of all, just take a look at their appearance. These creatures usually grow to 40 inches long, and they can weigh up to 110 pounds. You can say that they're easily the ugliest animal on the planet, and I guess it makes sense that they live in the darkest, loneliest, and the most terrifying part of the sea. These fish have huge heads and a huge mouth filled with sharp translucent teeth. Their most distinctive feature is their lure, which is only worn by female anglers. This lure works just like a fishing pole, hence the name anglerfish. The tip of this lure is luminous, which attracts fish to come closer to their mouth, and just like that, they'll get their meal for the day. Now you might think that they're only eating smaller fish, but these guys are wild. They can easily swallow prey twice their size. Are you terrified of them yet? You probably think that these guys have at least one redeeming feature in them, right? Well, nope. It gets worse though. If you think dating is hard, then you don't know how hard it is for anglers to find their mates. In fact, it's so hard to come by a female anglerfish in the abyss that when a male encounters a female passing by, he will bite the female and latch onto her using their sharp teeth. As days and weeks pass by, males will become one with the female. Literally, the male will fuse with the female and connect with them skin to skin. They'll slowly lose their eyes and all of their other internal organs, except the reproductive ones. Wild, right? I guess you can still say that despite being macabre, the idea of a forever mate isn't so bad, right? Spoiler alert, female anglers will carry up to six or more males on her body in her whole lifetime. As they say, when you find the one you love, never let them go. So are you spooked out by this fish yet? I am. Number 7. Box Jellyfish They're transparent and they seem to be just floating mindlessly in the ocean and it's because they quite literally don't have brains. Some species of jellyfish aren't really harmful or deadly to humans, but the box jellyfish is among the deadliest. In fact, their venom is considered to be among the most fatal in the world. Box jellies primarily live in the coastal waters off northern Australia, but they can also be found scattered in the waters of the Indo-Pacific Ocean. They sometimes appear to be pale blue in color, and they're known for their distinct cube-like shapes. These harmless-looking creatures can grow up to 15 tentacles from each corner of their bell, which is the main body you see. Each one of those tentacles are equipped with about 5,000 stinging cells. If you ever get stung by one, you best believe that you'll suffer from excruciating pain. The box jellyfish has toxins that attack the heart, the nervous system, as well as skin cells. In fact, their sting is known to be so painful that victims die from shock and drowning. However, if the victim is lucky enough to have medical attention, they would be in considerable pain for weeks on end. So if you're on a beach trip and you see a jellyfish warning, you better heed and listen. Number 6. Stingrays You're probably already familiar with stingrays. They're quite commonly featured in shows, and they're commonly seen in ocean parks as well. These disc-shaped creatures with fins that resemble wings may look harmless for the most part, but their long, thin, whip-like tail will give any deadly animal on the ocean a run for their money. You might already know this, but stingrays aren't really seen as dangerous. On the contrary, they're known to be incredibly gentle creatures. Rays can be as small as a dinner plate to as big as 17 feet long, including the tail. They usually spend their time swimming while searching for prey, and they don't attack humans unprovoked. However, if they ever feel threatened, they can easily use their tail to smack you. And trust me, it's not a fun experience. 
Their tails are covered with one or more barbed spines which can inject venom that will make their victim feel immediate pain. Number 5. Great White Shark If we're talking about the most dangerous ocean creatures in the world, it's a given that the Great White Shark will be included. The Great White is one of the deadliest shark species on the planet, but give me a chance to clear up a little bit of their bad rep. It's true that Great Whites are responsible for the most unprovoked attacks out of any other shark in the world, meaning these guys will attack you just because. They might even go as far as to swim towards you just to try and eat you. They have sharp teeth and they can shred you to pieces in a matter of minutes. But after research, it was found out that sharks only attack not because they want to eat you, or any other humans for that matter, but instead they simply might have confused you to a baby seal or another fish. Then again, it's better to be safe than sorry. If you see a great white in the water, just stay out of it until they leave. These 15 to 20 feet torpedo predators aren't really worth the risk. And now it's time for today's topic. If you see a jellyfish warning near the beach, it's sometimes better to just prevent yourself from swimming and have your dream vacation next time. Trust me, you don't really want to end up like this man. Not all of these gelatinous plastic-like creatures are venomous, but most of them contain toxins. Sure, some species are completely harmless, but some are also incredibly deadly to the point that one touch and you're as good as dead. This jellyfish in particular is fiery red and orange in color, and you know what vibrant colors usually mean in the animal kingdom, right? Yep, that's correct, they're most likely poisonous. In fact, there's even one species of jellyfish that can fire stingers from the tips of their tentacles to inject venom to their prey. What's more is that their venom is so severe that it's about 100 times more potent than the venom of a cobra. Now you know that if you ever see this while swimming, it's game over. Have you ever seen a jellyfish before? How was your experience? As always, comment down below with the hashtag today's topic and let us know your opinion about what we just showed on screen. With that said, let's keep things moving. Number 4. Killer Whale Orcas and killer whales are perhaps among the most well-known ocean creatures. They're one of the very first animals you'll learn to recognize next to the dolphin and the shark. Their names already tell you that they're dangerous. But in reality, these 23 to 32 foot long carnivores don't pose danger to humans as long as they're given enough space. You can say that their name is a little bit misleading. They don't really kill humans, well, usually, and they're actually the largest of the dolphin species and not actually whales. They often prey on fish, penguins, sea lions, and whales. Orcas are on top of the food chain in the ocean. These creatures are incredibly smart and they're often raised in captivity to perform tricks in front of audiences. However, there have been a couple of incidents in the past where captive orcas caused the deaths of their very own trainers. Number 3. Titan Triggerfish Just its appearance and its mouth alone is probably enough to terrify you. There's actually a higher chance that a Titan Triggerfish will attack you unprovoked than any of the other animals in this video. If you're a professional diver and you've explored the oceans of the Indo-West and Central Pacific, then you probably already have experience with these creatures. Titan Triggerfish can be extremely aggressive, especially when they're guarding their nests. They'll chase you away, and if they happen to bite you, there's a chance that it'll cause a serious infection. Number 2. Flower Urchin This is the Toxonustus, aka the Flower Urchin. It's quite obvious how it got its name, but formally it's known as the Toxic Foot. They may look a bit prettier than the other sea urchins, but they also hold the title of being the world's most venomous sea urchin. In fact, their sting is so powerful and potent that they're even recognized by the Guinness Book of World Records in 2014. Number 1. Moray Eel Moray eels are considered to be both wonders and horrors of the ocean. Most divers want to get a glimpse of these creatures, but many also find them to be extremely terrifying. Moray eels can range anywhere from 6 inches to 12 feet in length. Once you see their sets of teeth, you'll immediately realize the damage these creatures can do. If a moray eel ever bites you, the injuries can range from minor to incredibly serious. So the next time you're admiring coral reefs and shallow waters, it's best to steer clear of these creatures' paths. Have you ever encountered any of the sea creatures we mentioned in this video? If so, how was your experience? And do you know of any other terrifying ocean creatures that you think we should have included in this list? 
Let us know about your thoughts and experiences in the comments down below. Also, check out our other cool stuff showing up on the screen right now, and I'll see you in the next video. Take care, everybody.